Great Awakening family, I'm back. Hello visitors and friends, you are welcome. A newcomer, you came just in time. Let's get it. Today, we'll be making some cranberry juice. with carrot and blueberries. I'll give you the ingredients to this juice as we go. So let's get started. All right. I lost a little more weight. I'll pull the camera up so you can see. How about that? First, I like to say I'm determined to make this channel work. I also, since I've been here, learned a few things more about lighting and so on and so forth. So let's get it. I'll be giving you the ingredients to the things that I make. I'm going to do more cooking with you. I'm going to walk you through a day of Brenda's Keto. Um, there's two large carrots washed, cut up, ends cut off of both. Cranberries washed, blueberries washed. So let's do this. Let's get our day going. So I'll start by filling up the chamber with the blueberries, carrots, and cranberries. It's a lot in store for you from this point on. I'll share whatever information that I need to so that our um, channel will be better more professional and more inviting for because we want to get more people in here so I want to help you lose this way so now that the chamber is full I'm halfway through so what's been going on They're great for antioxidants. Carrots is full of vitamin A. Any berry is good for you. It's less natural sugar and more nutrition. So, I feel the same once. I lost a little more weight, as you can see. So I'll step back. And 
and I'm going to be doing a whole lot of cooking for you. So you can see how I do my keto life. Fill the chamber up again. Usually, with two large carrots, a cup and a half of cranberry juice, I mean uh, cranberries to make this juice, and a half a cup of blueberries. The blueberries and cranberries is excellent for you. Cranberries is good. You should have them every day. It's good for your uterus. Carrots is full of vitamin A. It's good for your eyes. So let's get the mallet in so we can finish juice. So don't forget the ingredients. Two large carrots, clean, cut from both ends, a cup of blueberries, and a cup and a half of cranberries. So why don't you tell me what you've been got, what you guys been up to while I wipe down? That way you can see what I do on a daily basis doing keto. Cause I intend to help this channel grow and be more informatory to you guys. Oh, I can't wait. You know how I feel about carrots. I got a whole lot in store for you. Out of sight doesn't mean out of mind. I have been sick. My teeth, you know, was broke. So it broke on off, but I'm finna get that fixed. I was like, I'm not gonna let that make me wait. <laughs> Anyways, talk to me. What's been going on? That tastes divine. I'm glad that I'm I'm very glad though that it went on and broke so I could go to the dentist because of COVID-19 I've been kind of scared you know because we talking about blood people so on and so forth but I'm not going to let that stop me from being the best I can be I'm glad to be back. And I can't wait to smile for you. So, 
first thing in the morning, I usually have carrot juice and carrot juice alone. So in further investigation, I found out that every day, whatever time it is, women, we need pure cranberry juice. No watered down, concentrate, or whatever. Cheers. Here's to us. I've been working on my mask from being tired. My eyes were getting dark. So I came up with a remedy for that as well. Dry skin, oily skin, combination skin, whatever the case may be. I'm going to do some facials for you. Rough feet, no problem. It ain't none of those sea salt and different oils can do. I'll tell you the ingredients to them when I do it. Won't be no more dry. Like crickets in the background. I figured out my my um, music, as you can hear. Cheers. Here's the weight loss. My ideal weight is 172 pounds. I have 17 more pounds to go. And I know it's gonna be a breeze, just like riding a bike. Once you learn how, you can never forget it. If you haven't rode in a long time, you might be a little wobbly at first, but it will work. Also, I feel like people don't do juicing because A, they don't know how. So, I'll show you how I do it. Oh, I'm exhausted today. I had to cut, wash fruit, freeze the bag it, and so forth. And then it came to me, why didn't you show them that? So that they'll know how to do. So, today, here on out, I'll show you step by step how to bag the food, wash it, prep it, so forth. Also, I'm gonna cook for you. And uh, you're gonna like the menu. So let me wash my cup out so we can talk a little bit and get things going. I love that, but I can never figure out how to get it. You know, something that smooth. So let me show you that after I've used my machine, I never let it sit up. That's a no-no. It'll dry up and become an awful mess. I'll show you that as well so you can get used to using your juice. Mine's a little different. I bought what I thought would be the biggest, you know, and uh, the easiest to deal with. I 
I miss you guys. Something terrible. I just felt like, well, to be honest, I felt like y'all made me feel as though what I accomplished wasn't anything. 76 pounds is a lot. I didn't want to lose my weight fast. My body is in total ketosis. So I had to eat and jump too to slow it down because I don't want to look sick. So the first thing I do is put my bag in the sink ready for me to throw the fields and so forth away. So let's do this. The first thing I do is wash the chamber. Put my cup in the, you know I use bleach. Then I rinse everything. I'm going to put no towel in all this um, fruit and vegetables. This is breakfast for me. Sometimes I'll show you each day. I'll just switch it up. I don't uh, be content with it. So on and so forth. Okay. Once you get that rinsed off. That ought to do it. So let me get my bleach back. I wash these two pieces first. So, and I, this is the most important part of your juicer. Don't ruin this because you're going to run your machine. Nevertheless, let's get it. So I can't wait to cook this food. I don't always have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I eat when I'm hungry, not because I'm supposed to eat three meals a day, but when I'm hungry. So since my body is in total ketosis, I was losing so fast, I started looking sick. And that's something I don't want to do. So anyway, so I washed the mallet first, then the cup that I made the juice in. So I always sleep. And I found this towel tough enough to put up in me. <laughs> Yeah, don't ever leave your juicer just sitting on the counter because you will have a hard time getting it back together. So I always wash right after I finish. And as you saw, I rinsed everything away first. And then I started to wash my Rinse it off with really hot water. The bleach to kill down and the water assists in that. Set it over there to dry. Watch this part, the very important part of your machine. Inside and out. Because if this is rough, it's still no good. And I paid good money for my machine. So I don't want that to happen. 
plus, this is how I eat. This is how I'm able to accomplish my keto game. So I sit that over to the side. Then I come back over here. This is the important part of cleaning your machine. This you need to know. Okay. Now watch this. I keep a bag in the sink. Any plastic bag will do. I start going counterclockwise because my machine is round. Getting a leftover hole from the machine out. I put all that right over in the bag. I do not put this down. My I got it disposal. You're looking for trouble. Once I get all the hull out, same thing. Just a little patience, a little tender love and care. And your machine will service you for years to come. So now, while this is filling up, I'm rinsing it off. Like so. I take my bag down, get all the hole in, and I set my stand up so you can see what's next. Sometimes I think I'll be being too careful. Let me let it back so you see. Okay, that's better. Then I take my bag, put the holes in it, wrap it down real good, stick it in the garbage can. Yeah, I miss you guys really a lot. It's just, you know, I had jumped on here and I hadn't studied and, you know, to know the ins and outs of what I'm doing. Please pardon me for that. I'm going to make sure you get all in the chamber because you don't want to drag stuff from before in your machine. The nipple, all of that needs to be cleaned out. So I take the flute. Sometimes if it's really hard, you know, from the uh, metal straw to dig it inside. That happened to me because I had let it dry. That's what made me learn not to do that again. Then I take my towel. I'm shaking the excess water off. Start from the bottom. Work the fat. 
and voila, your machine is clean, dry, and ready for your next suit. Hopefully the stuff in here, like I said, will ruin the screen. I'm going to take you over. Show you what else I'm missing. So I put everything, just, you know, in the bowl. So I take it over with me. All the pieces. First thing you want to do is get your bowl in place. You can stick the mallet back in the tube. Then you take the nipple and make sure it goes back through the hole where the juice is dispensed. Now, worse is over, and the best is yet to come. I do swing it because it's a screen to further dry it. Now, things are coming together. The mallet is already on top. Two point two. Your machine is ready to work again. I lock it in place. Unplug it. I'm so tired today. When I go to the market to do my haul, I have to pick out the stuff that I'll need for a month's journey. Cause I'll show you something. This is my freezer. My cranberries is froze. Blueberries is fall. This will last me a month. When it comes to my freezer, put all the meat down and all the keto up. So it's easy to get to your already washed, cut, and frozen strawberries, spinach, carrots, anything that you need to make a good tooth. And I wipe down my counters. That way I'm ready to cook my next meal. Bleach always. I'm glad to see you all today. And I hope that I uh, I can present a video that you would be more than proud to watch and learn from. That's my main objective. It's my channel. The lighting and everything, I'm working on it. And it's doing better. So do me a favor, family. Friends and visitors, share like comment come in my e-box in my mailbox or in the comment Brenda I'm trying to lose X, Y, and Z I'll be doing my workout with you as soon as I get through cooking cause we finna eat good normally I don't do the cooking back to back cause it'll be a couple of hours before I feel like eating anything but I just want to make up for lost time because that's like I want to look gorgeous I'm sure you do too and if people don't give you your flowers don't wait for it go get your own like I did. I always keep more than enough water.
on deck because you need to be drinking purified water. I feel so good. Words can't explain how good I feel right now. Because of you 